Hello and welcome to this new video of the ESP32 list. Today we will see together how to store your sensors data inside the Google Sheets. We will not do that directly, but we will use an intermediate site called IFTTT. Basically, we will send data to IFTTT and the site is connected to Google Sheets and will handle storing the data through something called the applet. This is the site you need to connect with an account. Now I will create the applet between two services. The first service is a webhooks. You need here to connect to the service. Now we will give a name for the event. For the action service, choose Google Sheets. The action will be adding a row uh, in the spreadsheet. In this video, I will send the two values, so here I will remove the last one. In the end, click on Finish. Now our applet was created. This is my Google Drive. The IFTTT folder is still empty. Now let's start the programming part. First, I will connect it to the network. When you use the IFTTT site, you need to call this block. Here, the event name is is uh, ESP32. For the key, follow these steps. The key here is all the string next to the last slash. Here I will send the two values. Before sending them, I advise you to put them inside a string variable. Otherwise, you might have an error.
The first data will be the internal temperature sensor and the second will be a random number. But it could be of course your sensor's data. Here I will here uh, sorry I will send uh, the data every five uh, seconds. Now we are ready to upload uh, the program and see the result. Here a folder was created and the spreadsheet that contains uh, my uh, data. In the end, I hope that you liked the video and see you soon. Bye.